In this lecture, we'll be discussing advantages of MongoDB. The first advantage is it has got no schema. That is, it's schema-less. As we have discussed till now that MongoDB is a document-based database in which one collection holds different documents and a number of fields, content and size of those documents can be different from one another. MongoDB is easily scalable. It enables horizontal scalability by using a technique called sharding. Now, sharding distributes the data across physical partitions to overcome the hardware limitations and the data is automatically balanced in the clusters. We have ACID properties at document level. ACID, as we know, stands for atomicity, consistency, isolation, and durability. These are a set of properties of a database transactions. It has got a failover mechanism by making use of replica sets, and this is automatically handled. If the primary server goes down, the secondary server becomes the primary automatically without any human intervention. And it also supports common authentication mechanisms like LDAP, AD, and certificates. Users can connect to MongoDB over SSL, and the data can be encrypted as well. MongoDB can be cost-effective solution because it improves flexibility and reduces cost on hardware and storage. So, these are some of the advantages of MongoDB. In upcoming lectures, we'll be exploring more about MongoDB.